Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying the limited edition Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer cereal. This is hot cocoa flavor. Uh, this is made by General Mills. It's a family size box. It was $3.98 at Walmart. Pretty cheap. For that much cereal, $3.98 these days, that's a, that is pretty cheap. Um, it says uh, sweetened corn cereal with marshmallows. That's what it is. Um, one cup, 37 grams, is just the cereal. With no milk is 140 calories. It says on the side what the thingies are. Oh, we have brown flying reindeer. We have Rudolph's red nose. The green one is a Christmas tree. And the blue one is Hermes hat. <laughs> okay. Kind of. And there it says, join in the reindeer games. If you want to be a reindeer who pulls Santa's sleigh, just like Rudolph, then you must train hard. Flying practice. Paw at the ground, then get a running start and leap into the air. Challenge your friends to see who can fly the furthest. <laughs> at our age, you'd be like, uh, who can hurt their hip the first? <laughs> okay. Antler tag. Gather your herd, then put your fingers on your head like antlers and try to tag your friends while they run away. <laughs> Definitely a young person's game. <laughs> Bumble escape. Take turns pulling each other on a sled to see who can run away from the bumble the fast. <laughs> Will you be the bumble? Uh, no snow? Then see who can run around the place where you live the fastest. I want to totally get out in the front yard with, run around. with everybody uh, going down the street and, and can, can pretend he's the bumble. Oh my That's lord. Funny. Okay, and then it says hang with Rudolph. After you're done playing games, you can cut out your Rudolph ornament. Have an adult help cut along the dotted lines, fold over the top, and tape the bottom to make a hole for a string. So they have a little Rudolph down there at the bottom. Uh, that's hilarious. Hilarious. It's good for young kids to get some ideas to run around. It's not bad cereal. It's it's mm. it's, it's it's somewhat chocolatey. It's very sweet. Mm -hmm. I think yeah. it's nice. The marshmallows are your typical cereal marshmallows. But the cereal itself, it tastes like chocolate. Yeah. It tastes like sweet chocolate, and there's a little bit of a grittiness to mm -hmm. it. Um, I really do like the level of sweetness that's in there. Yeah. Uh, when I um, when I buy cereal, I'm not buying it to be healthy. Um, so for me, I, I I like the sweet. I like the amount of marshmallows you get. I do Quite too. It's, and you, it looks like they put a ton on top, no, which just, surprises me. I just me. dumped it, so I didn't try to. Honestly, it looks like there's more marshmallows at the top than there are at the bottom, which almost never happens. Um, but I, I do like that because this is this is really pretty. Okay. It tastes better in milk. I mean, it tastes good both ways, but it tastes better in milk. Because I like that. Um, I don't know. It just softens it up a bit. You know, I think it tastes just as good in the milk as out of the milk. Um, and, and we don't say that every time. Mm -hmm. Some think, sometimes when you put it in the milk, it, it either takes away the flavor or it, it, it accentuates the flavor. This is pretty much the same. Pretty much the same. I wish the chocolate flavor was a little bit stronger, but... That's both ways, in and out of milk. The chocolate flavor is, it's there, but it's not a really strong chocolate flavor. But it's good chocolate. It's as good as any other chocolate cereal. I don't know that I would have necessarily guessed hot cocoa. No, just um, like chocolate. But they're going with, you've got the milk, you've got the chocolate, and you've got the marshmallows. Yep. So you do, you have made the hot cocoa by adding the milk to it. So uh, I see why they called it that. 
I think this is really good mm -hmm. cereal. Yeah, uh, it's actually better than like Cocoa Puffs and stuff, I think. If you get it, uh, if you, and your kids like uh, chocolate cereal, sweet cereal, if you like that yourself, I think you will like this. Mm -hmm. I think it's cool. Um, if you wanted to, this is one of those, if you collect the box, this might be something you want to collect because it is a limited edition box and it has Rudolph uh, on the front. Yep. If you haven't watched Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, in years, um, or if your kids have never seen it, it's slow, isn't it's it? It's very slow. I mean, it's good. I grew up with it. It, it. it is good. But then again, there's some points to where it's like, compared to cartoons today. Where it's like, ah. Yeah, this this is one of the slower ones. Yeah, it um, actually tells a story. <laughs> yeah, but, it, but, it, but, yeah it, but it is a good story, and it is still very enjoyable. I just think if your kids have never seen it before, or if you haven't seen it in a long time, you might have forgotten that, that it is a little bit slow. Mm -hmm. um, but always fun for Christmas, definitely. So I will have a picture for you at the end, and thanks for watching.